We kick 2017 off by congratulating Prayat Maksang for clinching his 10th Asian Tour title a week before his 51st birthday. The Thai veteran became the second oldest winner on the Asian Tour and has qualified for this year's Open Championship at Royal Bergdale together with Yong Han Song, Pacharao Kongwatmai and JB Kruger. As usual, the Singapore Open attracted some of the best in the world, including Sergio Garcia. The popular Spaniard unveiled his new wardrobe for 2017 on Twitter a week before heading to the Lion City. El Nino was joined by Asian Tour Ambassador Ernie Els and three-time Singapore Open champion Adam Scott at one of Santosa's main attractions. At Madame Tussauds, the trio bumped into a colleague. What does one do when one encounters a tiger? Take pictures, of course! Hoping to also one day have their own wax figures in the museum, they found a blank spot to pull a prank on an unsuspecting golf fan. The Singapore Open field had a big mix of nationalities, so what better way was there to introduce them to a complete local experience than to let them sample our national fruit, the durian. Whew, stinks. What are you guys doing? Known also as the king of fruits for its large size, thorny husk, strong odour and acquired taste, players on the range were challenged to hit a durian or try its flesh. Needless to say, we got some pretty good reactions, so keep a lookout for the full video on the Asian Tour website coming out soon. <laughs> it's quite common to hear people say, I could have done better than that when you watch golf on TV. And this year, some fans could actually put their money where their mouths were. At the second tee of the Serapong course, some amateurs got the chance to challenge the pros to a closest to the pin competition. Nine-year-old Braden Lee stole the show when he teed it up with his all-time favorite idol, Adam Scott. Now I heard that you got special permission from your teacher at school to be here, is that right? Yesterday I told her, to, tomorrow I'm going to Sentosa to beat the pro for golf, so she needs my parents' permission. He looks very intent. He eyed that target down. Good looking shot. No. Oh. Now come on. Come on down. What a great effort that is. That is a fantastic t shirt. Unfortunately, not good enough to win the prize, but he is going to get a little prize by the looks of it because Adam Scott has just signed his glove. Speaking of children, the top performing Singaporean last week, Quincy Quirk, welcomed his baby daughter, Olivia, into the world just days before the event. Here is the adorable Olivia giving her daddy a fist pump to show her support. I haven't slept since she was born, so it's, uh, I've, um, I've lost track of time, honestly. Golf is the least of my worries right now. And here's proof of just how spaced out Quincy was having to deal with a newborn while playing his National Open. Knowing what Sentosa's like in the afternoon, are you going to change your approach heading into tomorrow? Same, same. Just uh, make sure I burp her and uh, put her to bed and you know, attend to her when she cries. So, same, same. What about the game plan for the golf, though? Oh, 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 golf. Yeah. See, so that's what I mean. Totally forgot about. <laughs> Quincy, I hope you get lots of rest soon and, of course, hang in there. The beautiful Santosa Golf Club was awarded the best course of 2016 on the Asian Tour. On behalf of the Asian Tour, I'd like to thank Santosa Golf Club for being our 2016 Course of the Year. Andy, thank you so much for the uh, great cooperation. Thank you, Santosa Golf Club, for having us. We look forward to coming back real soon. That's all I have for you today. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you on tour.